guys, Matt V's Movies back for another video. And today um, I've got a small package in the post. And I also want to just briefly to um, mention, and it's a bit controversial this, why I turn this off. Okay, so just before we start the video, if you're new to the channel, welcome. Please consider subscribing by hitting the subscribe button down below and hit that notification bell. Welcome back to existing subscribers. Hope you're doing well. Um, please consider commenting on the video. Um, I'm sure this might bring some comments. Um, please also give the video a thumbs up. Really do appreciate, appreciate it. Um, Please follow me on Instagram. I'm on there as well. And uh, yeah, I sometimes post videos um, and some pictures on there. So yeah, go follow me over there. So, why did I switch this off? Now, this is probably quite controversial. Um, I haven't ever seen this film as a child and so I'm going into this as an adult and uh, I watched probably about 45 minutes of this and unfortunately I had to turn it off I just couldn't get into it um, I don't know whether it's because I'm getting older <laughs> um, but um, I found the characters in it annoying <laughs> I found the, the children just constantly shouting all the time and yeah, I just, it was just winding me up. I just thought, I can't, I can't continue with this. Um, now, I'm being honest, which um, I think you should be, you know, whether you like a film, not everyone likes the same sorts of films. And I know that a lot of people do like this film, and that's fine. Um, everyone has their own opinion. And, um, you know, um, we all have different opinions. And I think... Because looking at this film from an adult perspective, I'm not getting that same nostalgia that probably a lot of people did when they watched this in the sort of 80s and possibly early 90s. Um, so, yeah, it's a real shame because I was really looking forward to this um, film. You know, I'd heard a lot of good things about it. And I'm sure if you're revisiting this from your childhood, you're probably going to get a lot of, you know, what rewatchability from it um but for me no i just could not get through it now i have to say the 4k picture quality is brilliant you know it was a really nice looking transfer um the sound sounded good i mean i was only watching it on a tv so i didn't have the surround sound or anything like that on um but um but yeah great picture quality it looked really good uh, the HDR was, um, you know, doing a good job. But, unfortunately, no, this film just not for me. Um, which is strange, because I really love the Indiana Jones films, action, adventure, all these kind of things. But, um, I have to say I'm not the biggest fan of E.T., which is a similar kind of film, I suppose, with sort of children in it. Um, again watching that as an adult i can take i can take it to a certain point but um it's not my favorite um but no i'm afraid for me i couldn't get through this so uh, it's just not a film that um i want to revisit so there you go folks that's just a, an open honest review from from an adult perspective you know this just isn't for me this film so okay so we'll get on to the unboxing now so I uh, just wanted to sort of put my thoughts out there. Let's get into this package. Okay. What have we got? It's a lenticular magnet. The film Days of Future Past, the X-Men film. Um, managed to pick this up, cheap as chips, on eBay. 
couple of quid. So I thought, yep, that'll be a nice little uh, extra bonus um, with my um, X-Men collection that I have, um, which you will be showing at some point. Just on the back, there's nothing. I believe this was part of a Zavi exclusive. Um, went on the front of the steelbook. Um, I didn't obviously get the steel book with this it's just the lenticular magnet uh, now this uh, this film I really enjoyed the X-Men Days of Future Past bringing this sort of the original cast Patrick Stewart um, and then obviously the uh, the new guys coming through uh, the um, <clears throat> X-Men films uh, you know it's sort of a timeline film so yeah it's a great a great film that one really enjoyed it so yeah that's just um a little men lenticular magnet that i picked up so thanks very much for watching the video guys as i say it's just an open honest review um you know of, of the film the goonies uh it's a real shame because i was kind of really looking forward to to watching it but no just not for me unfortunately so there we go but uh Anyway, thanks very much for watching the video guys, take care and see you in the next one, bye now.